capybaras and nutrias are mammals. More specifically, they are large semi-aquatic rodents with hairy, robust bodies. They also have incisors on both jaws. Since capybaras and nutrias are closely related, they look similar to each other. Because of these features, people may sometimes mistake one for the other. Then, how can we distinguish them? Although capybaras and nutrias are from the Rodentia order, they have different families. Capybaras are members of the Caviidae family, but nutrias belong to the Myocastoridae family. The easiest way to figure out the difference between capybaras and nutrias is to check their size. Simply speaking, capybaras are much larger than nutrias. Capybaras are 40 to 50 inches long on average. In addition, they weigh between 60 and 150 pounds. However, nutrias are 15 to 25 inches long. Their weights range from 10 to 20 pounds. Capybaras and nutrias have similar coats, but the color is different. Capybaras have tan fur, but nutrias fur is dark brown. Another clear difference between them is their tails. Nutrias have long tails that look similar to rats' tails. However, capybaras don't have tails at all. Capybaras and nutrias have different body structures, especially their faces. Capybaras have heavy and bulky body structures. Their ears, eyes, and nostrils are all on the top of their heads. Because of this, they can rely on all of their senses while swimming. But, the body structure of nutrias is similar to that of beavers or rats. So, not all of their senses can be used while they swim. Capybara's muzzles are also way larger than nutrias' muzzles. Capybaras seldom show their teeth, which are one color throughout. However, nutrias' brown and orange teeth are often visible through their mouths. Although both of them are herbivores, their specific diets are different as well. Capybaras eat grass, bark, and aquatic plants. But, nutrias eat entire plants, which even include the roots and seeds. They don't leave any parts behind. Because of this eating habit, nutrias have an infamous reputation for destroying crops. Capybaras and nutrias are originally from South America. Both of them enjoy living in and near water, but their specific living environments are different. Capybaras prefer to live in grassy or marshy areas. However, nutrias build complicated burrows and tunnel systems along rivers or ponds. Different from capybaras, nutrias are found around the globe. Capybaras and nutrias also show some behavioral differences. They are both very social animals, so they prefer to live in herds. But, capybaras have larger herds than nutrias. Capybaras are usually found in groups of about 10 to 20 individuals, but they can have 50 to 100 in the dry season. On the contrary, nutrias commonly live 2 to 13 in each group. Capybaras also don't sleep very much. Even though they do sleep, it will not be based on a set schedule. They usually like to take a nap in the sun. On the contrary, nutrias are mostly nocturnal, which means they are more active at night. Now you know how to tell the differences between capybaras and nutrias. That's all I have for today. Thank you.